Welcome back, folks. I decided to uh, follow up Dead Space 3 with Alan Wake, another horror uh, game. And, uh, you know, it's it's Halloween, or it's going to be Halloween pretty soon, so I thought this would be a good uh, follow-up. <clears throat> Anyways, let's start on... Okay, we're going to do normal, because I'm a girly man. <laughs> Enjoy. Stephen King once wrote that nightmares exist outside of logic, and there's little fun to be had in explanations. They're antithetical to the poetry of fear. In a horror story, the victim keeps asking why, but there can be no explanation, and there shouldn't be one. The unanswered mystery is what stays with us the longest, and is what we'll remember in the end. My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. Even his, na even his name is pretty cool. <laughs> wow. What an introduction. I've always had a vivid imagination, but this dream unsettled me. It was wild and dark and weird, even by my standards. So yes, it began with a dream. Following a typical nightmare pattern, I was late, desperately trying to reach my destination, a lighthouse. For some urgent reason, I couldn't remember. I'd been driving too fast down a coastal road to get there. I'd seen the hitchhiker too late. He was dead. I was convinced they'd put me in jail and I would never see Alice again. Suddenly, his body was gone. I was in shock from the crash. I could hardly see... Okay, we finally have controls. Or, well, we will in a second. There we go. Um, I might need to do a, a few minor corrections. Okay, look at... No, don't reverse my controls. Alright. Everything looks pretty good. What's... Oh my books. Okay, I had a whole I had a whole stack of books in my trunk. That makes sense. I'm a writer. So these lights, they uh they're basically like save points or checkpoints, if you will. See? I like had that. To go to the lighthouse. I knew there was something important waiting for me there. And in this game, it's Okay, it's just telling me to... Okay. In this game, it's really worth your while to go off the beaten path. You can find some pretty decent stuff. The bridge had collapsed. I'd have to find another way to the lighthouse. I, I feel like I'm missing something over here. Oh, well. But yeah, explore if you can. Sometimes you're being ch chased by... Uh, dudes so it's kind of hard to do that but if you can if you have time go ahead and explore and I think my mouse is a little oversensitive that's fine so these guys you recognize me do you Ryder? you think you're God so they you can just make up stuff play with people's lives they can't go into the light oh crap but the light just went out go jump jerk oh there we go so this guy he can run f uh, Alan Wake he can run for a while but uh, he does get tired and fairly easily like he has a pro he probably has a cardiovascular regimen like I do which is slim to none and uh, he will slow down and do this so so we got a shift and dot oh crap or you can just run right away from her like I did so let's just let's try that again. <clears throat> do it. Do your thing. Woo! Nice try. I realized that the hitchhiker was. All right, let's get to the. Story there we go. Let me get. Yeah, the light just broke. Who says I'm dead? 
I'm still alive, man. I'm doing just fine. Oh God, run! I run. I almost said Isaac. <laughs> uh, run, Alan. Go. You run so pathetically. See, this is as fast as you can go. Seriously, there we go. I do like his jacket. It's pretty nice. I'm. C I look. I'm pressing down the ship so hard. You don't even know. No. Oh, maybe. No, I don't know who he is. You need a flashlight. Hmm. Damn. That's rough, buddy. Wow. I was trapped. Um. No way out. Okay. You die. Can we turn these off? Yeah, let me out. I'm trying to get out. I can't go that way, apparently. Get to the lighthouse. I'm, I'm trying to get out. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. Yes. There we go. No, good. And you'll see... Oh, what the hell? You should go into the light. I'm trying to... Yes, let's do this. So you'll see me like, kind of like, uh... Oh yeah, and the light heals you somehow. Uh, you'll see me, uh, duck a lot, because... For he did not know that beyond the lake he called home lies a deeper, darker ocean green where waves are both wilder and more serene to its ports I've been. To its ports I beam. Do you understand? Absolutely. No. Not at all. Oh, he can remake. That's pretty cool. He can remake the stairs. Nice. Thanks, man. I entered your dream to teach you. The darkness is dangerous. It's sleeping now. When it feels you coming, it will wake up. There's no time. I can only show you the most important thing. The hitchhiker has been taken over by the dark oh, presence. You can't hurt him now. The darkness protects him from all harm. Only light can drive the darkness away and make him vulnerable again. Here, take the light. Okay. So the, the flashlight burns them. Burn the darkness away. Okay. There we go. You did it. Now I did it. No longer protects him, but it's still inside, controlling him. He can't be saved. He's still a threat. He is still give me a gun. Enemy. Then give me a gun. Here, take the gun. Now you'll die. Now you'll die, a hole. And the light kind of uh, also is a secondary function is your um, is your crosshair. So wherever your light is looking, it is also your gun's going to hit where the light hits. So. Even though, like, I have no shit. There we go. Oh, tap R to reload faster. Okay. So we're just going to run. We're going to be a little... We're going to be kind of... Um... I don't know what the word is, but uh, without being... There we go, grab some of that stuff. 
we're gonna be stingy with our bullets from now on. Because we can do this. Whoop! Oh. <laughs> okay, so they hit me. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, shit. Okay, this is getting real now. No, 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 no! Woo! We'll be okay. We'll be okay. We'll be alright. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Okay. Let's try that again. <laughs> I thought I could make it without, like, really, uh, killing anybody, but apparently, no. That did not work out like I thought it would. Do we go back this way? Yeah. Just like me. Okay. There we go. Okay, that'll work. Um, I did not mean to have that loaded, but that's... Running, 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 running. I'm just gonna keep on ducking and cut. There we go. Oh, shit. Okay. Wow, like, what? Ten minutes into the game and I'm already... I already died once. This is... This is not looking good, folks. Run your ass off, man. Come on. I know you can run for... I know you're a writer and everything, but, like, you look like you're in pretty decent shape. You're in better looking shape than I am, and I know for fuck's sake... I, and I apologize for my language, but... I know for damn sure that I can run faster than he is. I do have my... I do have it like the shift key pressed down too, by the way. This is ridiculous. Run! Oh my god. Anyways. That was pathetic. She's hot. Yeah, more than dozed off would be news for everyone. Cheer up, handsome. We're here. Welcome to Bright Falls. Looks like a nice, quiet town. Nothing could go wrong, go wrong here, right? Nothing at all. Alright. Let's act like we're on vacation. Go stand next to that old gentleman. I want you know, it's been probably a year sure. since I played this game, but my City god, this game looks fantastic. Damn yuppies. And and thank you, uh, I forget the name of the company that made this game, but uh, thank you for for uh, transferring it over to the PC, because it looks fantastic. Hello there. You picked a good time to visit our town. Deerfest is just two weeks away. Deer fest, huh? Did you hear that, honey? You have a lovely wife. If you don't mind me saying, I'm Pat Maine, by the way. Nice to meet you. Yeah. I'm wow, he looks a lot like Woody Allen. I don't recognize a famous writer such as Doesn't yourself. talk like him, but a definitely pleasure. looks like him. I'm an avid reader myself. I hope this isn't too presumptuous of me, but I'm the night host at the local radio station. Any chance I could get an interview? Look. Mr. Maine, I'm on vacation. In fact, I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. Wow, she's taking a lot of pictures, Jesus. Fair enough. You can trust me to be discreet. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely holiday. Oh, he seems like a nice dude. 
I'm sure we'll probably hit him up later. Later on in the game. What kind of car do we have here? Very nice. I got a couple of really good ones. Pontiac so or Lincoln? Okay. Ahead. That's cute. Right. Yeah. Hey, bestseller. How's my favorite writer? Are you there yet? Very. Yeah. We just got here. Are the locals giving you trouble? Just say the word, and I'll hop on a plane and come make sure that you're left alone, Al. No, Barry. We're fine. Great. Great. Just want to make sure you can relax. Charge. So, how is the place? Has it gotten your creative juices flowing? Barry, we're just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to Fresh make seafood. Okay. That sounds fantastic. There's a problem, okay? Okay. I'm just looking out for you, buddy. Mm. Talk to you later. I love you too, Barry. You know he's going to be calling you every five minutes. Barry is Barry. I can always turn off the phone. <laughs> what did I tell you? Where are we from, anyways? Let's see. From Barry. Society, Washington? I don't. I don't know if that's right, Colin, but that's. Come on, let's get back to the car. I can't read that license plate. What the hell? Sixty-eighth annual deer. I can't read that. I'm blind. I <laughs> can't. I couldn't read it though. We need to stop at the local diner to get the cabin key from the landlord. A Mr. Carl Stuckey. He's waiting for us. I'll go fill her up while you get the key. I'll pick you up here in, say, 15 minutes. Sure. Alan, thank you for coming here with me. I love you, too. Go on. I'll promise to behave. So, yeah, this uh, this first video that we're, I'm making, it's not going to be full of action or anything. It's just kind of, you know, exposition. But I can't talk. Exposition. There we go. I'm looking for Mr. Wake, Alan, wake. Oh god, I am your biggest fan. I know people say that all the time, but I really am. I'm glad to hear that. Rose. Rose, I'm looking for Mr. Stuckey. Carl Stuckey? Carl? Oh, of course, Mr. Wake. He must have gone to visit the restroom. He'll be back in a moment. Okay. I can't believe it. I've got all of your books. I got the cutout from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. Oh uh, yeah, so you did. And you keep it here. Well, okay. so good for you. Uh, right. So much for a quiet vacation. It does look like us, but it's like the photorealistic. Just it look. The funny thing is, like the poster looks more photorealistic than the animated character. Nothing but black coffee under a thin layer. I can't complain though. This game looks really effing good though. Do me a favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut number six in the jungle. Yeah, that's a good. Okay, you put the lime in the coconut. Sounds good. So, these two guys are kind of like old school rock gods, and uh, yeah, they're yourself a rocker. Unbelievable. They're having trouble with dementia and whatnot. As aging rock gods will do. You put the lime in the coconut, drink them both up. I'm doing Just it. Because we're brothers, don't think it I does won't that. murder Get you stuck. in your yeah. sleep. You Hit it. it there you go. I'm doing it for you, Grandpa. This is it. I've died and gone to hell. Oh, you know you like this song. Everybody likes this song. How could you not like the you put the lime in the coconut. It's great. It's good stuff. Oh, I guess I have to go... Shit. I am sorry. Like, I, I'm trying not to cuss too much, but... Uh, yeah. It just happens. Oh, he loves it. Good job. Good job, old dude. Enjoy your last uh, f few years left on this planet. I think I can handle it, ma'am. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stuck to, to get the key and get out as soon worse. as possible. The waitress was giving me a headache. Over fans listen. always get Are you kidding me? She's hot. Are you staying long, Mr. Wake? I can't believe it. 
I'm having a conversation with Alan Wade. Okay, she's a little needy, it sounds, it sounds like, but still, she's hot. This is what happens when you get Hit it and quit it, man. Don't do that. Don't. I'm kidding. Do not be a jerk like that, folks. Okay, where, where are we? Okay. Hello? Mr. <laughs> Stucky? Mmm! Unfortunately, he was taken ill. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lake. Okay. Oh my gosh. You could stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. Uh, old ladies in veils are not creepy at all. Totally not creepy. Um, what's... Oh, is that... Okay. Ugh. It's a special place. Very inspiring. Okay. You got lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. Oh, she's right about that. We've already seen that. Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you alright? The Andersons. Whoa, so much dialogue. Settle down, game. They wandered off from his clinic at the Cauldron Lake Lodge. Dude, that's that's okay. So like the epitome of a great game is when it just ingratiates you into the world like this and just dialogue heavy. I love it. So good. Mission accomplished. The key and the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights, just in case. Oh. Hey, wait! Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys! Hmm. Hmm? That diner was a real nut house. <laughs> Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. Okay? Okay. Dude, I would... Okay. Scenery... Uh, the scenery is great, but fresh seafood. Come on. What else do you need? I was a successful writer, but that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years. Not since my last book. Oh, sorry. Oh, they skipped a little bit. You can't go wrong with Roy, Roy Orbison. So good. Diver's Isle. It's gorgeous. Perfect. It's something, all right. Don't wow. Worry. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. I know. I'm okay. Why are you I looking like afraid. that? Quit doing that. The fear of darkness. There we go. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. Get out of here, crows. Here we go. Let's take a look inside. Come on. Destroy the lock just by clicking my left mouse button. It's dark in there. We need light. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? Um. Anyone here? Sure. Well, anyways, I, I think we'll take a break. Uh, this 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 looks like a good place to stop. Um, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the first episode, and I'll see you later, folks.